Hey, you guys. Uh, I want to talk about domestic, domestic violence. I want to talk about how it affects not only people in your family, not only how it affects you, people in your family, and everything like that. Hold on. Give me a second. Not only affects you, people in your family, your children, your community, your friends, your uh, anybody that know you. Men, please do not do do not hurt your women. And I heard all the time, oh, I love my women and everything like that. The words that you are saying. It's a weapon, rather an actual weapon. You know what I'm saying? Domestic violence is not something you want to joke about. If you have, if you and your woman are arguing and you don't like what she said and she don't like what you said and y'all get into it and y'all want to fight each other and y'all want to cuss each other out, y'all want to hurt each other's feelings and y'all want to say things that... Y'all gonna hurt each other work um y'all gonna say something it hurt each other. I suggest y'all to pop voice. Okay. If you are married, it doesn't require you to domestic violence your partner. Okay. Y'all can have a disagreement, but it doesn't take you that far to cuss your uh, your, your your wife out and to the point that you 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 domestic violent her behind her, on her okay if she hits you man if your woman hits you first walk away take a ride take a take a ride listen to music exercise swim go to jail hang with friends hang with family do stuff that it will keep your mind occupied to the point that you do not want to put yourself in jail or for attempted murder or murder, because whatever your wife said, you took it you, you took it too far to the point to kill your wife. All this stuff is not necessary. Okay, women, the same way I'm saying this to this man is the same way for you too. Okay, do not take this out on your children. Do not put your kids in the middle of it. Do not fight in front of your kids. Do not show your kids this looks this, this looks fun and game and these kids are looking at this and they thinking because my mom and dad going through it. So when I get older, I'm going to do that to my husband or my boyfriend or whoever. Honey, this is not fun. The message violence is no joke. This is not cool because in Jacksonville now, the message violence it is not a joke. Okay, to a police officer, to a judge, to anybody, a victim family, this is not a joke. It is half of people that died in domestic violence. Men and women died in domestic violence. All this stuff, we can change it. You know, how, how we can change it? By prayer. By voting for amendment four, by voting for gun violence, we have voice that nobody understands. And nobody does understand, but we do understand it. It is not easy, it's hard, but we have the chance to change it. What is you going to do? What are you going to do for the rest of your life? And how you going to live that life? And how you going to walk into your future? Your destiny is not far away from where you are standing. God made you the way you are. But God did not tell you to have vendetta against 